just doing all the dirty work. How nice was it having Severe back out there? Very nice. Uh, he speeds the game up for us. Uh, um, it makes it a lot easier for us as a whole because he could get downhill, um, dish, it, dish it out to our shooters who can make shots. And just, he looks for the open guy, so it's definitely um, enjoyable for him to be back. What can you say about this team's depth and just how many options you guys have? We have a lot of depth. Um, as you can see, a dude didn't play today, but he's a really good player. Um, he's still learning how to um, fit in and uh, find a role. But um, overall, I think we have a really good group of guys who's going to be ready when their time comes. What, what can you say, how to say about Ugo and just kind of how quickly he's grasped everything, really? He's doing a great job for us. Um, obviously, he still has some learning to do, but him being able to come into the game and affect, it, uh, affect the game uh, uh, positively uh, by blocking shots, it's very good for us because now a lot of guards are scared to go down the lane because they know he's blocking shots. He's even blocking bigs when they try to muscle him, so it's definitely good for him, and it's good for us. That Duquesne uh, head coach said that he's going to be making a lot of money really soon. Can, can you uh, confirm that? Yeah, he will be. Ugana, this is, uh, you know, your second or third game here in Rep Arena. What's it like when you're around that many fans in the same place, you know, first time here? And I'm still adjusting to, you know, this much crowd because I haven't been around on this much crowd. But, you know, as time goes on, I, you know, feel more comfortable playing around them much crowd. And I just need to work on, I just need to wrap my mind around the fact that I will have to play um, in an environment with most people. With the shot blocking <coughs> ability that you have, mm -hmm. the coach from Duquesne said it. He was even telling his players, he said, you go down there, you're just going to be coming right back at you. What does your shot blocking ability do for the defense? I would say you have the defense, you know. I feel like I've, I have the ability to stay in the game because of what I do, you know. The fact that I have the team, I'm defensively by blocking shots, I think, I don't know, I think it's going to give me more minutes, but I'm still working on other things. I'm just, for now, I'm just playing a role in the team, doing what I know how to do best to help the team. That's what I'm doing. At media day, you told me when you started practicing. Oh, hey. Yes, hello. You said, you know, it was kind of a rude awakening. You could block everything in high school, mm -hmm. and then you got here playing against these guys, and it wasn't so easy. It seems like it's coming easier to you now. Yeah, the fact that, you know, I said that because I've been playing against um, the same guys, so they know what I do. You know, they know when I'm coming for the block, so they know what to do. But. I said this one time, like, I was the best high shot blocker in high school, and I think I am in college. That's what we do. So, while I was playing fast, that not only gets the game to speed up, but we get into people's legs. Um, so, when you're making shots the first five minutes of the game, those same shots we were running at hard, it be a lot harder in the second half. And um, at some point, one team has to let go of the rope. So, we know if we stay the course, keep playing fast, keep playing together, then it's going to be hard for the other team to play that way for a four, full 40 minute game. You talked a lot in the preseason about being more efficient this season. Did you mean just from a shooting perspective, or is that everything I think in the game? I think that's everything. Um, I'm not sure what the stats were today, but I feel like I played a pretty clean, efficient game. Um, and you know, that's, that's what I'm looking to do, be, you know, keep it clean, keep it efficient, um, and get my guys, get my teammates in spots where they can be successful. So we're this guy said, you know exactly when you were going to go in, or did the coach kind of say, we'll see how like, kind of the flow of the game goes? I, and I did it. You know? I didn't think I was going to play this much tonight, honestly, um, being my first game back. But um, I, I, got to, I think I text Coach, like, I trust you. Whatever you, whatever you do, whatever the plan is, I mean, you're the greatest of all time for a reason. Um, you know, I trust in Coach and trust in his plan for us to win games. Did, you, did your stamina hold up, you think? Yeah, I, mean, I got my second wing, but second win. But like I guess I said earlier, I, I asked for a sub for sure. It's first time ever. Last time ever, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> You just talked about Cal there and how he's greatest of all time. You text him. What's just what's your relationship like with him now that in year two you've, yeah, this, got, you've I built mean, it now? This is great. It's a great relationship. Um, I feel like I can talk to coach about anything, basketball or not. Um, I mean, that's, that's a special relationship that I feel like I haven't had and I'm in a long time, aside from my dad, obviously, him coaching me. But, uh, man, it's been, it's been great. I mean, it's continued to build. I'm starting to know what he's going to think, what he's going to say, how he's thinking. Um, I kind of get to finish the sentences a little bit in practice. Um, so it's, it's been great. I mean, I love playing for Coach Cal. What 
What does that mean to a point guard when you have that kind of relationship? I mean, it's great. Um, I mean, you know he's going to tell you the truth. He's going to hold you accountable. He's going to let you know when it's not it, but he's also going to praise you when you are doing well. Um, so when you know when you're playing for a guy like that who truly wants what's best for you, and um, when you're at, when he wants you to be at your best so you can be at the best for the team and you guys can uh, make plays and win. So it's, it's just a dream come true. Are you 